Hey beautiful souls. So I look a mess and I know it and welcome to my channel. <laughs> but today I just want to vlog a little bit um, to show you how I care for my husband's hair. Today is wash day and hair day and he's getting his hair retwisted. So um, I just want to show you what I do to take care of it. And uh, yeah, baby. Hair feeling clean and fresh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, so we washed his hair after doing the ACV soak last night, um, and I'll do an updated video on how when we take his hair out, we do the ACV rinse every time, and then redo his hair again. So stay tuned. All right, you guys. So we're watching Thor. Ooh. You said. Yep, Thor. Thor. So watching a good. This is a show or this is a movie. It's a movie. Anywho, so we're watching a good movie, Pass the Time, and this is my oil mix. If you guys haven't seen that video before, I, um, I basically mix, we mix our own oil in a big bottle that he uses for his um, everyday spray to hydrate his hair and his scalp and treat his scalp as an everyday treatment. Um, so if you want to see what I do and what oils I put in this mix, I will leave the video link up here and you can click it when you see it. I did a video describing like what I put all in this mix and it's amazing for your scalp, your hair growth, hydration, healthy, happy hair. So we're gonna spray this all in his hair first Ooh. to massage. I cannot die, not until I fulfill my destiny and lay waste to your home. You know, it's funny you can mention that, because I've been having this terrible dream tonight. Asgard up in flames, falling to ruins, and you, Surfer, are at the center of all of them. Then you have seen Ragnarok, the fall of Asgard, the great prophecy. Now, hang on, hang on. I'll be back around shortly. Do I really feel like we were connecting there? <laughs> why did it do that why did it do that so you guys basically i just take my time and massage his scalp basically his his wash day his um his treatments are serious i must i massage his scalp a lot and just pay attention to the products i put in there i'm mindful of what i put into his hair but I really treat his hair. I love it. And it's all about hydration. You want to keep the scalp and the hair hydrated, especially when we're doing um, his hair that stays in for about two weeks. That's when I came across a path of death and destruction, which led me all the way here into this cage where I met you. And I like to do his hair while it's wet. So basically his hair is all moisturized from this and that was just a gentle a gentle spray just to hydrate after I wash it. I do a really um, deep clean with the apple cider vinegar, let it soak, rinse it out, and then today we wash his hair with a deep shampoo and conditioner, but you still need to hydrate afterwards. So that was just a gentle spray and while I'm doing his hair, I'm going to spray each row as I go with this too, just to do a deep hydration. Next, I'm just massaging this into the scalp. And this is something I got from a store in DC called Blue Nile. It has a lot of good stuff in there, I forgot, but it's like all natural, really beneficial for the hair. So I'm just gonna massage this in the hair and then I'll start. Smells really good too. Choose option B where I bust out the Sorry for that much. Not that you are off your head and stashing away in Asgard's vault. You cannot stop Ragnarok where I fight it. Because that's what heroes do. Oh, 
I use during this process is the Big Tooth Comb, which is really, it's much more gentle on the hair instead of brushing out his hair type with a little tiny comb. You need a big comb like this just to comb through so it won't tear the hair out. And then this, this is just for parting, combing out. Um, and, okay. So this is what I use to detangle as I make each row. Mane and Tail is a really good brand. Detangler, it's a really nice spray. It's lasted us a while, so as I go through each um, each part, I'm gonna spray this down, comb it out, and start. So it's super easy to comb out. It's completely Yes, well, it is best to respect our Super neighbors. Easy. Yes, of course. So, yeah, I just make each row twist it, spray it down. Taking my yeah. gel, the Eco Styler, just the olive oil. Shout out to Malaysia because this keeps his hair in for a long time. Um, I like to keep it on my hand so that it's just easy to go. Got my clips ready. Everything is here. Great. Getting there. Thank you. Getting there, getting there. But yeah, you definitely want to keep it um, gelled down at the root. Got my clips going. Shaky, shaky, shaky. Yeah. You know, nice and go small. Ahead. Stay here and enslave people for that. The lunatic. Keep drinking, keep hiding. But me. It's about nighttime now. It's been a long day. My husband went to go pick up this, um, this, um, dresser. It's basically a dresser, but it, he's going to put all his speakers and his music tools on there. I am like, I need to eat something. Anyway, so look what I'm doing. It's so much fun. Laundry and laundry there to fold. Because the day I did laundry, that vlog I did where I did all that laundry that day, I have not folded. I have not even been motivated to fold anything. But I'm folding it now. Um, Dominique's hair is done. And I'll show you what the room looks like when he brings that desk in and we set everything up. And guess what else we're doing today? Today was a busy day that we planned on anyway. But um, we are going to do our 23andMe test today. And that's like Ancestry, if you guys don't know, where you do like, um, it's like you just find out your DNA or you find out where you're from. Like what, what all types of races you're made up of, basically. Um, where your roots are from. So I'm excited to do that. Him and I have been wanting to find out where we're from all over for a long time. I cannot wait to tell you guys my results when I get them. I will see you guys in a little so, bit. The baby's back and all right, I'm just, this dresser is so beautiful. So this dresser? is like, what is it called? It's, it's a, a desk, baby. A desk, correct me, mister. Mm -hmm. Anyway, look how nice this is. This is his official setup. We had this little table, like we had our setup, it, we may do, but these are speakers I got him. It was for Christmas, right? Yeah. It was for Christmas and I got him these really nice studio speakers. Personas Eros 8. Personas. I got these yes. for him one Christmas. Anyway, so now we have an official damn stand. This is nice, honey. It's basically, you can call it a little workstation. Oh, this is nice. It's really big. And you said how much? $35. Damn. You happy, honey? Still, yeah. You happy, honey? Oh, best believe it. Dope, I can't wait to put my crystals on here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <chill. laughs> but it's a nice table to sit on. I keep calling it every day what it's supposed to be. <laughs> I don't know. Just deal with it. Mm -hmm. My mom is hungry right now. Okay. Oh, so well, this is nice. This is so nice, you guys. Little does he know. I'm going to be sitting on here, too. <laughs> oh, man. This is going to be beautiful. All right, I'm gonna let you get set up. I'm gonna yeah. finish the laundry. You gotta and finish product back. later, people. Huh? You gotta finish product later. Yeah, we'll give you an updated look later. Let me know when you're done, baby. Uh, yes. All yeah. right. Hey, you guys. While Papa is still setting up, I'm making a big ass salad because we have a lot of salad mix in the fridge. And even though I'm tired, I got a lot of energy today. So we're taking care of a lot of things. Anyway, so my big ass kale salad. Just a big, big, one big bag of kale. It's already washed. And 
what I like to do is massage it. So I just take a little time to massage it because it makes it less um, dense. It makes it softer to eat and it fluffs it down a little bit so I can add all the other stuff that I'm going to add in here. And you guys wait. I love this salad. So does Papa. He's like, you know, we're missing your salad. So, yes, for salad. Anyway, so these, this is all the stuff I'm putting in there. On top of, um, you know, flaxseed and all of this stuff and dressing. We have watercress. Watercress is so good, y'all. Yeah. A lot of good benefits of watercress. What cress? Crescent. Where is the watercress? Where is the name so I can show you guys? Okay, I got cress. Basically, it's watercress, though. Uh-oh, that sounded bad. Are you okay? Okay. <laughs> yeah, so I have press, green onions. I'm gonna chop all of these up because they're about done. I got two packs of carrots, depending on how much I wanna put in there. Probably just one pack, but we'll see. I have so many carrots in the fridge, so I'm trying to make two bags. You can never go wrong with carrots, come on. And then we have tomatoes. I'm gonna use this whole thing and green and red pepper. It's gonna be an amazing salad full of goodness. Wait and see. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna put some of the watercress in here and it's already pre-washed too. And I'm not gonna bother cutting this up at all. I'm just gonna drop some in there. So we have greens on top of greens. That's all. I'm gonna save the rest because we do um, juices and stuff like that too. So yeah. That's going to be saved. Mmm, it smells like greens. It smells like a good digestive system. It smells like energy. It smells like goodness and greatness. Yeah. Here's my green onions. It's basically what was left in the pack. And I just like to roll them together to get. I cut the tips off because those were a little withered. Withered is the right word, right? I don't know why, but this is so satisfying to cut these green onions. It always is. It sounds so crunchy and delicious. I love green onions, so, and because this is a really big salad, I might leave, I might cut it off. I use some of my eggs and his eggs in the morning if I do eat eggs, but um, I just like the flavor. So yeah, that's enough. Mm -hmm. So in go the green onions. And I just want you guys, I want you guys to see how pretty this is. It's green on green on green on green. Oh green, oh green, oh green. My salads are the best. Just ask my family. They love it. Right, baby? My salads are the best. Mm -hmm. I already have one pepper cut up in this whole thing. And this is the second one. So basically two red peppers. And I have a bunch so that's why I used two. Um, I didn't feel like cutting up the green. Either way, you can throw whatever vegetables you want in there, man. So yeah, we're gonna add the second. So delicious. I love cutting up um, vegetables and fruits and stuff like that. It's just so beautiful to me, the colors. Nutrient-rich foods, it's just so beautiful. Anyway, so yeah, put whatever you like in here. It's gonna be more of a vegetable salad. I'm not putting any fruits. I could cut up apples, but that's too much. Anyway, that's the fact. So I did not use two bags of carrots. That would have been crazy. Um, but I did use half of one bag, so that's that there. And then the tomatoes I just washed off. I'm not gonna um, cut these in half. I just, I like the big grape tomatoes. I like to eat them as is. So we're just gonna drop those in there too. Mix it all up. I'm gonna add my all right, 
right, so we're going to add some flax seeds. If you guys do not know about flax seeds, they are amazing. So look at this. Excellent source of fiber, which is great to use in the bathroom. Um, organic. It's pretty bomb. This is the brand Arrowhead Mills. And yeah, good stuff. So I like to put this on a lot. I keep the spoon in the bag so it's easy. And I just sprinkle it out all over. It does not have a taste, so it's just something like to sprinkle. Like some people would put sunflower seeds. This is just another little add-on. Now I used to have sunflower seeds which went amazing in the salad. If you have sunflower seeds, drop those in your salad too. It tastes so good. Flax seeds too is really good for women's um, vaginal health. So if you need natural lubricant, believe it or not, flax seed is really good for that. And then I'm also going to put some chia seeds in here. Chia seeds. Six grams of protein per serving. Again, this is a fiber as well. So not only do we have a green... I'm doing it very, very slow. Not only do we have a green salad, we have a salad full of fiber and nutrients. That's about it. Um. Okay, so I used to have nutritional yeast, which you guys know I love. Nutritional yeast, it, it gives foods like a cheesy flavor, and I left it at my in-laws. I would sprinkle that all in here too, but I don't have that. Um, let me see what else I have about it I dusted some black pepper all over here and I'm gonna just I don't put any salad dressing on this because this sits in this bowl until we finish the whole thing and we just take from here um, but this is a really good idea you guys if you have honey mustard and Italian zesty Italian dressing that mixed together is so bomb and that's what we use as our dressing for the most part every time honey mustard zesty Italian trust me you will just love it so that's our salad for tonight we're gonna have really good salad with our um, leftover goulash I would say that meal I made on my first vlog with the chicken strips and sausage I'm gonna have that with the side salad I know this looks huge a plate full of salad but I will be eating all of this like like this is my first meal of the day. I know this is so bad, but we've been so busy today. But doesn't that look so good? Yep, this is my goulash. It has the sausage and you have chicken strips. It's so good. It's really good over rice too, but we don't have any. But I'm going to eat it just like that. And then we have the salad. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Yes. This is, this, first of all, Dominique, this is the first time I'm seeing you set up like this. Mm -hmm. You can officially sit in this chair with a perfect level. <laughs> Damn, this is so dope. And he got his lava lamp, you guys, that I set up for him. It reminds me of Hustle and Flow when she bought him that lava lamp. <laughs> Remember, she's like, I got you this. She said, I saw all the rappers they had it, so uh, my baby has a lava lamp too. <laughs> Yes, this is so dope. He has his music picture set up. Damn, baby. This gets me excited to see you in here doing work now. Before yeah, he was set up all over the house. This is so dope. Yes, baby. I love you. I love you, too. Ah. This is dope. It's dope. It's dope. It's dope investment. You look at me, baby. Ah. Oh, sorry. Yes, you got your hair done today. You got your studio set up. Yeah. Damn, it's a good day. You know what you need next? Dinner <laughs> <laughs> and a kiss. Mm. Thank you. You're welcome.
Love you. I'm gonna leave you to it. Oh, this is my art wall. I did a lot of cool art. This is for my mother-in-law. She painted this. Isn't that cute? Shout out to mommy. My chakra picture from the grounding black all the way up to the crown color. Yeah, I was I was going through this phase where I just was yearning to do art again. And I still I still will do it. It's just been a while. Definitely not anything serious, but this is just I let the paint take me where my spirit was wanting to leave me, I guess. Yep. Hold on, let me turn these lights on. You guys know I love these. I know. So excited! <laughs> Later, babe. All right, my beautiful souls. I think that's about it for today. It's been a really long day, and I am ready to eat dinner and um, get in the shower. And yeah, me and my baby will be doing the 23andMe Ancestry DNA results. So you guys look out for that video. We will be doing it tonight, but look out for the video. You'll see everything from how we do it, how it worked, the process, to the results. So that video will be up once we get the official results and everything, but keep your eye out for that and you'll see how everything was done. I cannot wait to share that experience with you guys. Thank you so much for watching my beautiful souls and I'll see you soon.